Westcott, as graceful as an English country garden, the race course with an atmosphere all its own. To open the year's season, the sun makes one of its rare appearances to gladden the traditional scene. And if Ascot provides some of the best racing in the country, it also displays some of the finest fashions. Accent has always is on hats. These are made of human hair, incredible but true. Designer Nat Cashman took racing as his theme, a racehorse as his model, and produced this. And now to make it a royal Ascot, Her Majesty the Queen and the Queen Mother are present. The Queen wears a pink silk dress with a grey mink stole. With her mother, she makes her way to the paddock through the crowd. The little knight of the turf, Sir Gordon Richards, is to ride Frieza in the gold vase, the day's big race. Time now for the gold vase. Fourteen runners move up, and they're off with two miles to go. Lord Derby's Herculaneum is just in front of Prince Christian and Royal Task as they race towards the first bend. Out into the country and safe approval is making the running. Royal Task, General Ike, Freezer and Corrali are all there. Down towards the stands and into the last bend, the order's much the same. Now Corrali takes the lead. Freezer is close behind with Royal Task and Prince Christian not far away. Coming up on the outside is Prescription, number 17. Eve Smith is bringing him up to challenge Sir Gordon on Freezer. And he's passing him. Now he's after Corrali, who's still in front. And Prescription wins. Corrali is second and Freezer is in third place. Prescription, perfectly ridden by Eve Smith, scores a popular victory on the first day of 1954's Royal Ascot.